Thank you very much, Mr. President, and thank you, Madam Lagarde. Uh, I'd like to know what you think of the argument that ECB policy should look to repress asset prices, such as houses and share prices, so as to stop scarce financial resources being wasted in building up paper values. And that you should be looking to push down the prices of basic goods while allowing for higher returns to investment in green energy and transport, and looking to deliver massive investment in energy conservation and green energy, transport agriculture, and public housing. So, so should the central bank not make more money a lot more expensive for the rich by hiking up interest rates? And uh, providing cheap money for investing in the things that the majority of people and the environment need. Thank you very much. Well, thank you so much for your question, but it, it's precisely the mandate of the ECB that was assigned to it by the treaty to maintain price stability. And what we are doing at the moment uh, by uh, following this this path of normalization of monetary policy is responding exactly to that, bringing inflation down and making sure that it returns to the 2% target that we have assigned for price stability at the end of the medium term. So that, that's what we are doing. It, it so happens that there has been, as we have signaled our determination to follow that path of normalization, there has been a repricing of assets that is taking place, has taken place, and uh, this is very likely the result of the signals that we have been given concerning this path of normalization that we are determined to uh, pursue in the months to come until we reach our medium-term outlook inflation target of 2%. Thank you.